fantastic performance from you uh, yourself, Apex, from the team as well. Quickly, before we dive into this match up and get into the nitty gritty, we were speaking yesterday, you were saying uh, positive mentality. That was going to be the key to Vitality success. Um, how was it feeling in the server today? Well, it's easier when you win like such side like 13-2 and 12-3, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yeah. the, the mentality has to be good, but those two, we stayed focused as well. That's why we were able to, to come back on the second side. So, Monster Fortitude was perfect. Obviously, T side those two wasn't perfect at all, but the rest, we just fought till the end. And I said that if we have the right mentality with the player we have, I know we can do difference. So, I, we just won against Sense once again. And I'm just proud of the boys. How do you like practically do that? What are the solutions like you're actually telling the boys? Because you know it's all well and good saying you know we've got to keep positive, we've got to keep our mentality up. What steps do you take to actually make that happen? Actually, you know we're humans, so when we stop talking about it, we just forget and uh, we go back to some crazy shit. I would say. <laughs> so we just speak that a, a, a lot, like ten times before any games. When we do debrief as well, that kind of thing always, like, guys, look at yesterday. Even though that wasn't perfect against Proud, we had the mental fortitude. If we had the same mental, uh, the same mental fortitude against um, um, Movistar, Movistar, Movistar yeah, yeah, we maybe would have I mean, won. you got to because you're going to be facing them again. Yeah, so. sure. So, But today we can show that we can be a really strong team. It's so funny because I think, like, a lot of people will reverse their, uh, their shirts right now because um, obviously playing wasn't beautiful and uh, now it got better. It's nothing crazy, but we still beat the third best team in the world. So it's really important for us to get that kind of win because we know what we're capable of now. Yeah, that was a much better showing from you guys. You talk about very strong CT size. That was the key uh, factor for you in this game. Snappy can be a bit of a singular IGL to go up against. What kind of plan did you have? What kind of preparation you have for these CT sides? Well, I know they prepare really well uh, because uh, we just faced them two times already and this year, one in Pro League when we lost and one in Blast. So we know they prepare really well, so we try to just prepare ourselves as well, just trying to do the better thing. Uh, I'm not going to say what, because obviously it's a secret, but we just had a good preparation again. And I feel like when we have this kind of preparation, we like really, really good. Mm -hmm. And I'm just yeah, proud of my boys because Everyone stepped up today. Okay. Like uh, Mizuta has uh, had a really bad uh, dust too, and he woke up instantly on Mirage, being like top fragger, 16 5 or whatever. In those kind of things, Magisk was like super crazy, the world best of three. Yeah. Just feels good. I was sick on those two, but he had no teammates. So <laughs> everyone stepped up today, even me. So that just feels good because once again, when people are showing up, when we do that kind of things, we know what we're capable of. Let's hone in on that, Dustu, just a little bit as well, because um, I, I want to ask sure. where your, your own map pool is at the moment, because you know we saw you going up against uh, in, in the last best of three series against Movistar Riders, picking into overpass, a map that we've seen you know start to pick into. What do you feel of the current state of your own map pool at the moment? Well, uh, I think that's why we got better the last two events, because our map pool improved a lot. Our nuke was really shit for quite some time, <laughs> and now we have four wins in a row against G2, twice Ents, who are the, probably the best team in the world on it. Uh, with Navi, obviously, and FaZe, but I mean, they're still really good on it. Um, we have Overpass as well. Our Overpass improved a lot. We couldn't pick it uh, against anyone. Now we get better. Obviously, the showing yesterday doesn't show our level on it because it's not about... We could have played any map. We could have picked any map yesterday. It okay. would have been the same. Mm. So I just think that our map improved, our map pool improved. Uh, we didn't show up on both uh, Vertigo at this event against Movistar Riders, who are, like, insanely good on it. I think our map pool is get, getting better and better, and I'm just really proud of that as well. It's just important to have a strong map pool nowadays because otherwise, like for the first three, four months out of the team, I think people picked Mirage against us and lose, yeah. lose, lose. So that was really hard because we put a lot of time on Mirage to get good, and we we, we showed it today again. But we we the other map were like put on the side a little bit. So obviously it takes time to get a real map pool, and now that. Our Mirage is fixed. Mm. It just gets better on all maps, and yeah, we put a lot of work on it. I mean, I mean, I went back from Blast, and I just the day after I just started working because uh, I wanted to good preparation for Cologne mm. and coming here. So yeah, it's all about that, and I think we do good lately on that. From the outside, you've had a couple of rough T sides on maps you've picked. You mentioned the overpass; it was just as well here. Do you think it's related to the map, or is it just overall mentality issues, or any kind of factor you would put in? <laughs> Uh, no, yeah, I mean, this start, T pistol, we don't win T pistols. Like, obviously, it doesn't, doesn't help. But uh, also, about, I will take care of now. I, I will say to Danny, I will take care of because our, my friends don't kill people on T, T pistol. I get nades. <laughs> so now I need to entry again, I guess. But no, yeah, to, to be more serious, I think that we start really bad on the T sides. We lose most likely first, uh, I mean, uh, Eco 
And if we don't win the first by round, it just gets us like into a bad spiral, and it's really tough. I think our T-Sign can be good. I mean, wh when we win uh, T-Pistol, at blast we won way more T-Pistols, and we showed up like really good T-Sign. So no, we need to have the good mental, the mental fortitude to come back when we yeah. lose Pistol and first by round to come back into the game. Today, we had a good opportunity at 5-0. Diha is alone B. We try to get into the side. He's alone. He kills two or three. We had the right call, but we don't do like the headshots at that moment. So I don't think our T's are bad. I just think that we get, need to get into, into the momentum in a better way. Well, Apex, are really great to get some words with you. I'm sure the Vitality fans will be very happy seeing you take this win. Of course, going to be too? taking that uh, rematch against Movie Star Riders tomorrow. Which is yeah, yeah, we have to get a revenge this time, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. I, mean, I need to revenge my G2 friends and <laughs> ourselves as well. Well, very much looking forward to seeing that going down. Let's throw it back on over to the desk to close this series out. Salut.